Hello everyone. Today's question is the angles of elevation of the top of a tower from two points at a distance of 4 meter and 9 meter from the base of the tower and in the same straight line with it are complementary. Prove that the height of the tower is 6 meter. So suppose this is a tower and for this virtual line has been created here this AB with yellow line. Now it is said there are two points. Let's suppose this point be C and this point be D. It is mentioned that these two points are in the same straight line and at a distance of 4 meter and 9 meter from the base of the tower. So this was the tower AB. So this BC length will be 4 meter and BD length will be 9 meter. One more thing, the angles are complementary. That means if I assume this angle is theta, then this angle will be called as 90 minus theta because they are complementary. Now here we are having total three triangles ABC, ABD and ACD. So I am writing these three triangles here C, A, B, C, A, B, D and A, C, D. See here ABC is a right angle triangle, correct. ABD is a right angle triangle, correct. ACD is not a right angle triangle. That means we are not going to use this triangle because trigonometry deal with only right angle triangle. Starting with in triangle ABC. So here we have to assume this as H and we have to prove that the value of H is 6 meter. Now starting with this triangle ABC because this will be your perpendicular and this will be your base this will be hypotenuse we don't have any role of hypotenuse in this question so I am going to use tan theta so tan theta equal to perpendicular by base so tan theta equal to what is perpendicular h by base is 4 let this be equation 1. Now in triangle A, B, D, we are to take tan theta, but here in this case theta will be 90 minus theta, angle will be 90 minus theta in angle in triangle A, B, D. So it will be perpendicular by base again tan 90 minus theta is cot theta now perpendicular is h again and the base in this case is 9 we know cot theta can be written in the form of tan theta if the right hand side can be reciprocally so it will be 9 by h because cot theta and tan theta are reciprocal to each other let this be equation 2 so here tan theta equal to h by 4, here tan theta equal to 9 by h equating equation 1 and equation 2, I am getting as h by 4 equal to 9 by h cross multiplication will give you h square equal to 36 that means h will be equal to 6. Yes, after square root we may get negative number but height cannot be negative. That's why the height of the tower is 6 meter. Thank you.